Hello folks, Marco here. Today we're gonna take a look at the brand new Easy Bass from ToonTrack. Actually, we're gonna try out the audio tracker function that is supposed to convert any source of audio that you have in MIDI. This means for us lazy guitar players that we can play a riff and have a perfectly suited bass line in a matter of seconds. Not only that, but you can arrange the bass line from scratch, choosing from different styles, tempos and so on. But since we're metalheads, we don't need a walking bass line playing over intricate chord changes. So let's see how it behaves against an 8-string monster playing super low and saturated metal riffs. For slaughtering this pure thing, I'm using my brand new Overload Themis 8-string and going direct into my Apollo Audio interface and through the Neural DSP 14 Nameless plugin. To make things interesting, I will play only on the low register to make it even harder for the tracker to keep up. So let's start from a simple riff and then we'll increase the complexity. Round one, fight! Okay, now let's speed up the process. Here I'm doubling the guitar track. Now we fit this audio into Easy Bass using this tune track thing. It's like a plugin that tells the software the audio input source. We select audio from a guitar and we press play. If we press amount we can see that Easy Bass has a threshold for how low in terms of velocity you want him to see. Adjusting the threshold we tell the software how many details we want but I fear it can be triggering some random notes so we'll leave it as it is for now. Let's hear the result without guitars. Nice, actually it matched the exact same notes and subdivisions. Let's hear the entire mix. Let's proceed with a more busy riff. This one is from an old song of my band Symbiotic. Has a death kind of vibe. This was played originally in D standard, so it should be fun hearing how it sounds on an X string. Split sounds. Round two, fight. Let's go through the same process, double tracking, importing the audio on Easy Bass. Now with this one I lower the threshold just to see what happens. Let's hear the result. I think Easy Bass wins also this one. Final round, fight! Finish him! Fatality!
So I think we have a tie, two for easy bass, two for the eighth string. But to be fair, this software was not meant to handle such a low register, I think. Now I don't see myself using this particular feature, but I think it's a very great tool for songwriters, people that don't have a bass or don't know how to play a bass and want something that sounds good out of the box. I mean, the presets are amazing. You can choose from finger to picked. You can switch between modern, vintage and metal. There are tons of plugins that do the same thing, but once again, I think tune track stuff, it's the best because this is very light on your computer. It sounds good, it looks good, and it has these songwriter features that no other plugin has. And if you think that you can come up with a bass line clapping your hands or tapping on the table, it's astonishing. So I totally recommend this, guys. I hope you enjoyed the fighting. I shall see you in the next one. <laughs>